Hey you guys, how are you guys doing? I hope you guys are doing awesome and amazing. You guys, thank you guys so, 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 so very much. We are at 2200, y'all. Got 2200 subscribers, I'm so happy. Thank you, thank you, thank you guys for all your support and all that good stuff, y'all. Okay, I'm gonna get right into it. Mm. We got a fish of purses trying to pop up out of there. Uh, you want to eat? Let's see what's going on. Mm. Somebody's getting a taste of their own medicine. Somebody could have been trying to hack your accounts or trying to do money transfers. So somebody could have been trying to mess with your money or something. So somebody could be going through a money issue right now. I'm hearing somebody, oh, uh, I'm getting, somebody saying somebody like wiped out their bank account. They may have, but they spent majority of that money on magic. Look, big time. Big time on a large scale. They went to a great extent here. And they getting a taste of their own medicine. Somebody's emperor or masculine. Fight for what you want. Stand your ground. Take control of your destiny and your outcome. So this person is mad. Because you stood your ground against them and you fought for your destiny. This person was trying to take control of you. So, yeah, now this person, this person did magic on you in the past. You probably didn't know. And when you found out, you stood your ground. You took control of your life and your destiny and you control your own outcome. You, you know, you are manifesting your own reality. Somebody trying to stop and block you from doing that. So now this person is trying to bring, well, you bring excitement to the world and you are all smiles. So when this person sees you, they try to be light, um, lighthearted and all that old crap. This person really is like obsessed with you is what I'm getting. Because when they see you, they're all smiles, but they, it's like they don't want to see you with nobody else and they don't want to see you move on. Yeah, because somebody's, look, yeah, you're about to live the life you were meant to live. A new addition, yeah, you're going to start something brand new. And somebody knows that. Somebody paid a lot of money. Well, they wiped out their own damn bank account to stop and block you, to try to control something. But, oh, um, yeah, some, look, somebody did not want you to step into your power. They're trying to block you. Superstars, what I'm getting, you could be... Uh, Aquarius or you just healed or somebody did not want you to heal because they knew how powerful powerful you would be oh but that keep sweat oh what do you say uh, you know you know mm -mm, my loving baby you got me twisted yeah you got me twisted you know he sound like he whining or something anyway so this person can be a whiner or a beggar or something like that. Yeah, this person just wants you to, it's like they want you to compromise and understand, but they don't want to apologize or take accountability. And they're trying to figure out why aren't you understanding their point of view or why can't they make you understand and why can't they make you compromise because it's not working. The magic, whatever I'm getting, the magic... They could have sent you some powerful shit. It backfired on that ass, though. I want to come talk to you, but I don't know what to say. Yeah, I bet they don't, because you know what the hell they were doing. Look, this person is struggling. Do you hear me? They try to make you struggle. That's that backfire. I seen the emperor when I was shuffling. Look. Can't make it up. They paid all their money to get some work done on your ass. You hear me? Somebody could be between the ages of, let's say, 27 through 28. But I'm getting like, I mean, 27 through 
38. So the 28 could be significant. Somebody could be between the ages of 27 and 47. Yeah, you change. They try to alter something on you. Whatever you do for work, they know it's going to bring you some type of unexpected income. So they try to change and alter you from moving forward or literally moving or moving up in your company, your business, whatever it is that you do. Yeah, they knew you were going to have this high honor position. And now somebody's concerned because something backfired. Whatever shots they fired off at you, oh, that shit came back to the ass. You done mastered yourself. Somebody didn't know. Look, it's an ending. It's an ending for this person and they're concerned. Yeah, because they got that message. Message of concern to the lover. That it's over. It's double over. They going through endings, and it's no chance they gonna get back with you. Is what I'm getting. Cause they were expecting for, they were expecting for a mature woman to be in despair here. This main male, yeah, he was trying to get on your path, your journey with you. Cause he knew your ass was uh, a divine feminine, and you, look, you the you the official person, you the real deal. You hear me? And they know a real emperor coming towards you. You already official person. You official. You hear me? You ain't got to worry about nothing. They know who you are, even if you didn't know who they were. And look, he know he's going to be left out in the cold. And there's an older, older man that's a wealthy man. They're concerned, too. Why am I this older man? They got the devil on their back. They got attachment on their back. Oh, they had despair. They didn't marry you. They were committed to like getting something from you. They were expecting for you to be gullible, honey. Mm -hmm. It could have been some men meeting up. The main male, the older man, and the wealthy man. They sat down and had a conversation. Somebody didn't even have enough money. They still owe somebody some money. Who owes somebody the money? So, so the higher ups, wait a minute, so the higher ups, they heard that they got message or they got word that the main female that they were trying to attack. It's on her journey to have a new beginning here. A new relationship. Yeah, a new beginning. And somebody could have been lying and said that they blocked somebody's gift of great fortune that was coming in. And they found that out. Somebody got exposed. Yeah, whoever this person was, they were being real childish. This or somebody's somebody's child. They were being real childish about somebody's sudden wealth. So they try to hurry up and get some work done in an opposite in a in a different community or they try to get a different witch doctor or something like that. Yeah, but whoever whatever community they went to, uh whatever this was, it was false. And then their community that they belonged to, they realized this person was false and they kicked his ass out. Somebody got kicked out. Yeah. His ass went broke trying to pay the debt. He done got extra debt. Yeah, he got another karmic debt, another contract that he's worried about. He got on his head about it. Look, he's in bad health. Wow. He could be having car troubles. He's about to spend some money on a car or get his car fixed too. Somebody could be going to court. 
having legal issues, somebody getting sued. It could be a married couple. Or a couple that's working together. They don't even have to be married. They just could be working together and trying to do work on the divine feminine. Wow. Mm, it's a lot going on here. Boy. People need to just get it together. You just sit down and worry about yourself, you'll be all right. And then if you got to do all that magic to make somebody love you or want you, it ain't, you should know it's not even worth it because why would you want to manipulate somebody to want you when, I, I don't understand it. If you don't want me genuinely, don't don't come towards me. That's just how I feel. That's just point blank period. Don't come towards me with that old fake love. Yeah, cleanse your space. You cleanse your energy of this person. Yeah, whatever contract, whatever debt you had with this person, it's over. This person, this it's over with this person. Yeah, look, it's clear like air. You hear me? Wow. I'm getting like you see illusions through tarot. Somebody try to get guidance through tarot to how to do uh, some type of altar or that's who they went to, a high priestess. A Libra Gemini Aquarius tarot reader. They have an altar with a high priestess on it. Yeah, setting intentions, doing magic spells daily, nightly. I'm hearing around the clock, day and night. Look, day and night. They setting up candles, doing rituals, using them visuals and ruins. And I said ruins, run, run. Y'all know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's the truth with this Ace of Swords right here. But you learn how to set some type of boundary here. I mean, you cut the cord. Somebody speaking the truth about somebody trying to bind somebody to a relationship. So this person went to a tarot reader to try to bind themselves to you. Yeah, this person trying to do some type of containment spell on your mind. Like I said, something about your, your imagination, your intellect. You know too much. You see too much. So somebody tried to do a containment spell to block that. Yeah, they did some little powerful. This little witch. This little witch bitch. Did a little powerful little containment spell. Scribing in water or blowing breath in water or something. I don't know. You had to try to freeze you and block you. Doing freezer spells and shit too. Doing mirror magic. To try to get your... Your... Uh, like try to switch souls with you. Yeah, but you see that ass clearly. You too damn balanced. You hear me? Somebody trying to throw you out balance so you couldn't get no prosperity. I'm getting like they don't want you to wear the crown. They don't want you to wear the crown. Somebody wants your spot. Yeah, something about the autumn to the in the winter. You could be going through a rebirth, like right now, uh, awakening or something like that. Somebody trying to block your prosperity, but that's about to balance out in the winter. I mean, yeah, autumn. If you're having money tr troubles or blockages, that's because somebody was paying somebody to do that to you. Yeah, it's a towel. They shocked. That you know about the death smells and the, the secret about the dead and what they do at night and what they be trying to cook up at night and writing them books and meetings and all that old shit. Yeah, because you're a divine being. That's why you know. You are a fucking goddess. You hear me? Yeah, and that shit alchemized instantly. You know how to alchemize it. Look, you heal instantly. Soon as daybreak, you hear me? You heal. You get that message and you heal. You do what the hell you got to do. I'm getting spirit about to tell you something too. Uh, something that happened in the summer. It might put you on your emotions. 
But um, somebody was trying to send a spirit to your uh, to your house, to your foundation in the summertime to make you have a, a towel moment in your love life or whatever. Yeah, somebody was doing magic on your soul, uh, your sacral and your soul plexus chakra. They were lighting up candles, look, doing rituals constantly. Yeah, because they thought that they were going to have some type of beach ring success. But look, you see where that water going to? Right to your sacral and your solar plexus, your root chakra, all that. All this healing. Yeah. Yeah. You you healed. You cleansed your energy. And you cloak, you're, you're cloaked now. You're stable. You're balanced still because your ancestors... And your familiars, they help you ground yourself. Yeah, you know how to protect yourself and your foundation. Yeah, because somebody show sent this gene to try to hex you. And that was the intention. It was to intensify some type of moon ritual or moon magic or whatever. They were using moon cycles. If somebody used the wrong moon cycle, mm-hmm. Yeah, they were trying to change and alter a masculine that's coming home to you. They don't want you to have love. They doing all this because either the 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 uh okay your ex lover he he don't he most definitely don't want you to move on. He don't want you to have no love. And then whoever he working with, they could like the person that's coming towards you, or they may be an ex of your ex or an ex of, or they may be dealing with I don't know, or the person that's coming towards you. It's a good catch or something, and they want them. Somebody need to sweep their house. But whatever death spell or endings or whatever they try to send your way, that shit was cleansed away. You hear me? Clearance. You hear me? Seriously, you got clearance. They on your side. The underworld is on your side. The underworld is helping you cleanse and clear out all this bull crap somebody done sent towards you. Find you something to do, please, and thank you. Find, find something better to do with your time. You go heal yourself. You wouldn't. I, that's what I'm saying. I, I'm not devious like it. I don't understand. And I have been through a lot of stuff. And I'm, mm -mm, I couldn't walk around with no heavy heart. Ain't no way in the world. Somebody's praying you be lonely, disappointed. Lonely, disappointed. All off by yourself, sad, sick. Yeah, all because somebody and they pride and they ego. Wow. What try to fall out? Look, they praying. Do you hear me? They are praying for this. Wow, spirit. <laughs> it right out. Wow. All because you getting a level up or shit. Somebody could be pregnant. You birthing new ideas. And you're expanding, and they don't like that shit. I ain't never been worried about nobody like this. I don't care, never. And then, if somebody worried about you trying to take that man or something, I hope, let me tell you something. First of all, a real divine family, you not nobody's sad bitch. And if you are, you don't know. Because if I've ever been anybody's sad bitch, I didn't know. I've never intentionally went and messed with somebody's man. I don't, I, I don't got that in me. No, never. I, if I have, I don't remember. And, and hell, I've always had a boyfriend. Yeah, I, I'm not saying that they didn't cheat, but hey, I didn't know them hoes. Excuse me. I didn't know them. Did I know them spirit? I may have had an idea because I felt a little disturbed as you hit me, but hey, I didn't know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That is crazy. Mm -mm. Somebody did this, this uh, prayer, this offering. It is professional. Don't promise to cause some type of disturbance to somebody's new idea, whatever they're birthing. Mm. Fight for what you want. Stand your ground. Take control of your destiny. 
for somebody trying to cause a disturbance here. Supernatural. I got right back out idea. Look, to curse you because of your talent. Somebody don't like how talented you are. Somebody could be a cook or you just multi-talented here. And somebody hates that and they trying to curse you. Wow, they're trying to block your ideas and shit. They're trying to take your ideas. Cause a disturbance to your... Look. Trying to trap you. But now somebody want to reconcile. They want to compromise. Or whatever seeds they were trying to plant. You bring excitement into my life. Look. Yeah, because you love your damn self. And now somebody want to apologize because you're a fucking sweetheart. You don't do all that bullshit. But that's like self-care, self-concern, self-healing. The natural world needs you is what I'm getting off this. And whoever this person that uh, people worship or look up to, they real prideful. They want to apologize. Somebody want to apologize for praying that you uh, have low self-esteem or you don't know your self-worth too as well because they were in their ego. Wow. Yeah, because that's what they were desiring for you to be assed out, collective. Yeah, look, somebody was desiring to trap you and rob you. Rob you blind, steal from you. Yeah, keep them. you be lonely, whoever these friends or this team, whatever it is, yeah. They took the bribe. But they see you've been trying for this for a lifetime. Mm-hmm. They stubborn ass was just trying to get some type of um, fulfillment. Somebody thought that you didn't see them or hear them or something. Or they would block your, your crown and they would get your blessings, whoever this third wheel is. And they made. They try to cause you an accident. Trying to create blockages and shit. What about two, two, two? Some Cardi B, I run this shit like Cardi, yo. Mm -mm 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 -mm. That's why I don't like it like that. I guess you run this shit like cardio. You ran this shit, yeah. They were trying to buy your ass. They were trying to stop you. Babe. Yeah, because they knew you were going to win. So they were trying to control you. <laughs> wow. Who of these friends are this team? And your family. Damn. They teamed up with your family? Or whoever you got a family with to try to bind you? Bind. Bind. They want to buy into your contract. You're about to live the life you always meant to live, collective, and they know that. Because you're not binded to this family no more. They can't stop you. You run this shit like cardio. Somebody may need to do some cardio. Somebody don't want you to exercise. They want you to sit your ass down. Whoever these friends are. Yeah, I told you they're doing something around the clock. Look, they're scheduling this shit. This team, they planning to try to catch your ass up. Now, somebody want to plan to team up with you so you can teach them something. Even though they uh, protest against you or thought you were inadequate or whatever. Oh, this may be some religious people. Say religion, pray, donation. So they might be trying to give you some type of donation or pay you because you got evidence on what they were ready to do or prompt to do, what they be preparing to do. Wow. So you okay, collective. You might need to pray and meditate to gain... Uh, well, somebody see that you're okay and you pray and you meditate and you gain victory and success by doing that. 
So I guess that's how you preparing and that's how you receive your evidence or something like that. So that's why somebody's trying to block your crown. But um, it's a struggle. Cause you smart as shit. Wow, yeah, but that could be want you to teach them something. They gonna promise, you know, that they gonna teach you or whatever, but it's a fucking trap. Yeah, they're trying to trap you. Cause they need your support. They want your support. And they want to attach themselves to your wealth. Yeah, wow, collective. Yep, look, they want to partner up. They need your help. Mmm, some got some soup. Somebody may, I don't know. <laughs> Somebody may try to come and say, I'm going to sue you if you don't take this money and be quiet. Hey, you can't, if you speaking the truth, you can't, they, they can't sue you for you speaking no truth shit. They can't get mad. But yeah, that's what I got for you. <laughs> you guys, I'm a lady life.